everyone and welcome to my Birchbox unboxing video for June 2017. I got this rather big box through my letterbox yesterday I believe. It's actually bigger than normal and I've already seen that we're getting a Birch bag this month, not a Birch box. I can't remember ordering anything extra so I'm not sure why the box is so large. Okay, this is why it's so large because actually the Birch bag is quite large. I was expecting it to be smaller than that. So the choice we had this month was actually what colour birch bag we wanted. It was either a mauve or yellow or mauve and light green I think that is. So I went for this one just because, I don't know, I thought that looked better. Okay so the theme is supposed to be day tripping because the birch bag colours are supposed to represent like little beach huts in somewhere like Brighton or whatever. Quite a useful bag I think considering it's quite big as well. I'm going to put out my first product now so I've not seen any of the products in this month's box so Whatever my impressions are going to be, that is my initial impression. So the first product I've pulled out is Scrub Love. It's a hydrating coconut oil body scrub. Okay, so I've used coconut oil quite a few times in beauty sort of regimes. I've used it to whiten my teeth with Coco White. I actually made a review video on that if you wanted to watch it, I'll link it above. And I've also used it from in my hair a couple of times to kind of smooth out my hair. This is obviously a body scrub, which I haven't used it for yet. And you're supposed to use it on dry skin, which is interesting because I usually use body scrubs like when I'm in the shower a bath but it still advises you to use it in the shower or bath obviously when there's no water in there because it can get a little messy. There's a thing on the back saying hey babe are you ready to get dirty? <laughs> it's 100% natural and yeah that's quite a good product I'm looking forward to trying that out. Apologies for my bouncy hair by the way I'm waiting for this to drop and it just doesn't seem to drop. Next product is the Cow Shed Moisturising Hand Cream. Now I've actually already got one of these from Birchbox, not in my Birchboxes like subscription wise but I actually I had a little order on Birchbox a couple of weeks ago now I think and you could choose a free gift and I think one, one of them was this so I've actually got two of these now but what's good about this, this is full size and it's £8. I'm going to try this out, I don't know if I should leave my rings on or off. Yeah, that smells really nice. It's got some grapefruit in it, which I can definitely smell coming through. And I am a bit of a hand lotion addict, especially at work. Like, I always put on some hand moisturiser after I've washed my hands. So, I might as well just have another one. Right, next product. And, whoa, it's in Greek. Oh, it's um, Corez Milk Proteins 3-in-1 Cleansing Emulsion. I never realised Corez, like, the brand was Greek. Pretty sure that's Greek writing, anyway. Okay, at first I thought this was like, I don't know, some sort of moisturiser, but it's actually a cleansing emulsion which obviously cleanses and tones your skin whilst also removing makeup as well, so that's the three in one. And I do like the brand Corez, I think I've had a few things from them in my birch box before and they've always smelled so good and just, yeah, been really lovely. There's a sticker on that, I can't say. Oh god, how do I get this off? <gasps> Comes out quite suddenly. Mm. I'm a bit scared to open that again just in case it pops all out again but that sounds really nice um, I don't think you hot cloth cleanse it you kind of just rub it all into your skin and stuff and it says here to remove it with cotton pads right okay I've got two products to go or have we this is definitely missing right oh no <laughs> well it turns out I have a product missing and that is the Meech and Maya brow liner which is a full size item as well worth £12.99 obviously a brow liner it's a brow liner um, apparently it comes in different shades so hopefully they've got my shade right but maybe I can tell them that when I've said that it's actually missing from my bag the other item I have got though and this is the last final item unfortunately it is the Ara Enhance waterproof eyeliner in a very sort of millennial pink colour. Okay so apparently it's supposed to give you like a brightening wide awake effect if you put it on the inner corner and outer corner of your eyes. I think I've already got some on so I'm not going to be able to put it on my eyes but I'll do a little swatch on my hand so you can see. So as you can see it is definitely quite bright. I don't know if I'm kind of scared of these sort of eyeliners because I feel like you know those Japanese Harajuku girls like they have like really bright white eyeliner under their eyes and they look very doll like and sometimes I feel like those eyeliners can do that but um, I don't know if I use it subtly it might be alright 
So I'm sorry about that guys, I can't show you the main item Birchbox seemed to be the most excited about this month, which is a shame. But if it's happened to you, it's not a problem, honestly, I've had it happen to me maybe two times before. You just need to email the Birchbox customer service email and they send one out straight away, like no questions asked. So they're quite good with that really. But if you've liked my video today, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I do these Birchbox unboxing videos every month. Oh, if you're not subscribed to Birchbox, I always leave a link below in my description box, which if you subscribe through that link, then you get £5 to spend free in the Birchbox shop. So thanks for watching everyone, and I'll see you next time. Bye!